Okay, guys. Let's check out our new city. So can we read that sign? Beware of falling rocks. Well, that's great. Oh, hey, lady. I miss da my daddy. When's he coming back? This is a key note of what's going on in this city. Notice she misses her daddy. Let's go inside this room. What do we got here? Look around. Buy anything you like. Oh, okay. Talk. Hello. I only need lots of items. See anything you want? Well, it depends. What do you have? Okay, you are the items vendor. No, we don't need anything from you. Thank you. Do come again. What about you, sir? The weapon shop. Hello. What would you like? You sell middle swords. You sell power spears. Oh, ho, ho. the bronze lance. The middle axe. Dun, dun, dun. The power staffs, which we don't need. And the steel arrow. We're going to do some upgrading. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, let's show what we did. May has gone from the bronze lance to the power spear. Ken also went from the normal spear to the power spear. Arthur we did not upgrade because, well, we're not going to use Arthur, unfortunately. Gort went to an axe, it was like 4 attack increase. Luke also went to an axe, another 4 attack increase. And that is it for the changing. Gein can't use an axe, so he stays at the middle sword for now. Onward with the storyline. So let us explore the town a little bit instead of just running straight and doing, you know, missions and all that crap. We got girl down there who's missing her dad. What do we got here? My father was taken away to the quarry too. Please bring him back. Oh boy. Two missing dads. Let's go in here. Notice these are all women. Please rescue my husband from the quarry. You're our only hope. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're our only hope. What's in here? Nothing unusual? Well, that's right. Oh boy, what's through here? A secret passage to nothing. Well, that was very, very much of a letdown. Onward to the rest of the city. We've done the left houses, talked to that chick already. Go in the- ooh, red roof. Hello, old geezer. Oh, there's a man here. I am a master alchemist. I can make anything. Can I help you? Sure. First, you must help me. Oh. Okay. To cure Xylo, I need to make Lunar Dew. But to do that, I need a Moonstone. <gasps> From Pokemon? To evolve Clefairy into Clefable? You must go to the quarry to find- I don't even know if that's right, guys. I was just thinking- I think it is, but it's been so long since Red and Blue. You must go to the fairy to find the Moonstone and bring it back to me. We will be playing Pokemon. We will. I don't know if we'll start- I don't think we'll start all the old ones, but we'll definitely go. Maybe Platinum's where we'll start. Talk! Don't go this way. You'll be forced to work in the quarry with everyone else. Whoa! Alright, madam! We are not going to head to the quarry, though. We're going to go up top and explore. This, this town's... Stop, stop trying to avoid me. Our men were taken away to work in the quarry. All but Xylo, who's crazy. And what about that old man right there? Please, don't go this way. They'll punish me for... Ooh, punish you? Hello, what is that? Okay, I don't need that guy. Oh, hell no, we're blocked. Come on. Come on, I know you wanted to have people walk around, but that's enough. Okay, headquarters. Now is as good a time as any to check it out, even though we're going to have some memberships. Here is our active roster. Oh, someone's dead. Oh, Arthur. Oh, shit. I forgot that he died. God, he's so worthless. Anyways, that's what they look like when they're dead. There's always going to be an open spot because your guy will go here. This is the Shining Force, okay? Now then, but we have more members. Here, at, right now, we only have two. And they're chilling out at the bar. We talk to them. Boring. I want action. Don't worry, you'll get it. Talk. It feels good to rest. Yeah, yeah, you just sit there and rest because you guys are worthless. I'm going to go res Arthur and then come right back. Yay, it only cost 40 bucks to resurrect my dead knight. Woo! Okay, so we come and we talk to this guy and we're going to have him join and... Basically, we're going to tell him who we want to bring into the group. We want to bring both birdmen. Actually, him and his sister. So this, is the, this is the female. This is the male. So we're going to go ahead and bring them in. Now, who do we wish to leave behind? Okay, there's a few ways we can do this, unfortunately. So I'm going to go over the strategy I'm going to use. You can do the one healer strategy. You can do the two healer strategy. 
you can do the tree healer strategy. For right now, I'm gonna stick with the three, uh, the three healer. We're gonna get rid of Arthur. Yes, we also wanna take Amon in. And now, this might seem like a shocker to you guys, but I think we're gonna sit Henri from what I wanna do. Um, basically because, sure, she's a mage and whatnot, but she's only single target, and Tao is by far superior. And the fights that are coming in here are grouped fights with AoE, so I'm gonna actually process this a bit. It comes down to Henri or Chris, who I know is only level 2, but still. Ah, let's just sit, Chris. Get the hell out of here. Anything else? No, I don't need anything else. Hope this doesn't come back to bite me in the ass. We'll see how the battle goes. Let's look at the new lineup now. There it is. Da -da. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, now we're outside. Let's see what we got here. We got a little side entrance. Oh, here's a female who always moves out of the way when I want to talk to her. I really feel sorry for Zylo. Do you want to hear about him? Sure. The rune cost army poured something into Zylo's drink. It made him crazy. We had to lock him up to protect ourselves. We'll go out through the back in just a second. Talk. I've been waiting for... For the words of Shining Force, are you one of them? Yes, I am actually the leader. Great, you must help us. The Runefrost Army took our men to dig the quarry. No! They're looking for a weapon of the ancients. A laser eye. Diane can lead you there. If Silo were sane, he could surely help you. Oh, yes, he will. If you're going to the quarry rescue the men, you can count me in. Diane does the Shining Force. The Shining Force is gonna get huge. She's another archer. She's female Hans. Sadly, she's really not going to be used because she's not that good. <laughs> that sucks, doesn't it? I guess so it does. I don't know what's in there. Another little looking around. This brings us down to here. This is where Xylo's locked up, I think. Talk. Xylo's inside, but he's driven mad. Only Lunar Dew can save him. Oh, Xylo. Can you talk to me? No, he's pissed. Alright, let's move on. Alright guys, we've gone to the far right of the town to the quarry and... <sighs> Always the bridesmaid, never the bride. We're too late. Who would have thunk it? We've been too late everywhere we've gone so far. Master, we have found it. To be fine. <gasps> the laser eye at last. This is the end of that cursed shining force. Get rid of those men from Stoke. They are no further use to us. Alert! Intruders, alert! Even though that's a skeleton, not really a robot, but a wolf. What? The Shining Force here? Now? Stop them! We must have time to remove the laser eye. Okay. Alright. There we go. Time to go over the battle. Alright, here is the map. Now then, we've got units pretty much everywhere around us as we see here. Um, they're down. How do we win? This is just the layout. Let's go. Drop the layout. We have to defeat the Master Mage, this guy. Yes. So, technically, could we bypass everyone? Yes. Are we going to be able to? No. Why did we bring two flying units? Because they can fly over and directly to stuff. No, now, when we're walking through here, how is our melee going to hit these guys? Come all the way up and up the step and over? So ranged in flight is good, which is why I decided to keep Henri over Chris. Even she's got the power spear, which I believe she can throw now, making her ranged, which is better. Um, there's quite a way to go. Two skeletons, this guy's facing us. You normally don't see the back of sprites like that, so that's kind of cool when they're enemies. We got two snipers up here. Unfortunately, some dark mages. Scout, this is a cluster of an area down here. And some more fighting up here. Oh, so how do we win this? Well, we slowly make our way over. I mean, one strategy is send your ranged and your flying units and bum rush this guy. But remember, we want XP. We're not going to promote at level 10. We're going to promote at level 20, which if you're playing, if you really want to be OP, that's what you got to do. All right. So let's go ahead and do this fight. Back to Tau. And this is why you bring your birdman. Look at us. We're just gonna sit here, damn the TV so loud, safely out of their range, even if they moved up, they won't do anything, and the next time they get their turn, 
Oh, we're gonna swipe down and just attack those mofos. All right, May got the finishing blow, level five. Finally, she's catching up, which is good because she does stick around for a little while. Really, Tao just hit them both with blaze too, and it killed one instantly, and it brought the other one to one HP, which was kind of a downer because it would have been nice to kill both. Now, with these guys, I do not think they're gonna be strong enough to one shot, so attacking here would not be good. We're going to attack on the right side, or on the left side, depending on what you do. That way both guys can get an attack in on the same guy. See how much damage they do and how it looks when our birdmen attack. It's just what I thought, half their health. And 24 XP just for damaging them, which shows that they are in need of some hard leveling up. Oh, and the other one's fleeing. That I did not see happening. Oh well. We're gonna track him down. Oh, one shot on the mage! Ken with the power lance, 16 damage, and the mage only has 14. That's called playing this game. That's how you play this game. And those archers, I don't know, they're worthless, they're not even attacking me. Oh, kind of sad. But we do get to the part where there are the stronger version, which is why they're a different color. Ooh. Right onward. Keen, level 8, didn't even get the killing blow on the Dark Priest, which can be kind of lame. But that's why we bring friends to get the kill. I can't believe Ken's gonna attack again. He just attacked and got a killing blow. He just going again? Will he get another Oh, and another killing blow. My goodness. I don't know why this guy... And he's level 8 as well! That's not a surprise, because he's been getting... He's just such a strong fighter. And he's been getting killing blows left and right, and he's got so much health, which is another good thing. I do not want to risk her getting attacked by that skeleton. Oh shoot, nope, attack. Attack. If you do choose a bird, like only one bird, you want to bring Balberry. Definitely stronger, in my opinion, and cooler, and not that I'm sexist. Just, I've just, from personal experience, seems to attack a lot harder, even though they're kind they're the same. I don't know if it's the way the game programmed it or what, that's all. And now because May is ranged, which is just such a huge upgrade, she'll just miss. Okay, good job, May. One of our best characters. Balbury's already level 6, just flying in, attacking everyone. It's a short story, I wasn't filming, you know, I cut things out and whatnot, just all the turns that this takes and whatnot. The archer who was up here across from Gort, he finally attacked, decided to attack Gort, right? The oldest, weak, not weakest, but just the oldest, you know, what is he, 60 plus in this? So he attacks the oldest man there is, attacks, and Gort evades. The galloping geezer evaded the attack. What, what a beast, what a beast. Court level 8? Court level 8? Woohoo! Luke is also level 8. Cha cha cha! Cha cha cha! The game's gonna start moving now. Cha cha cha! Oh. Oh! The, the priest is actually staff attacking. Oh man, at 9 damage. He must have an ultra power style. We're gonna have to. We need to get a healer down. Our healers cannot move worth a crap. Unfortunately, and if you notice that the enemies down there are moving in to protect the cave. Tal will just do some normal auto attack here. Just want to get her. Oh, and she missed. What worthlessness. Oh my gosh. Oh, gosh, she finally hit. This dark priest has been evading everyone. In fact, it's only freaking uh, May's second attack that hit it, but let's e evade magic. Kill it. Oh, Henri. Worthless. She's gonna go. I'm gonna get rid of her so quickly after this. This guy better hit. Better hit, Amon. Yes, Amon. Good job. Good job. Now, level up to level 6. Good. Perfect. Doesn't get attack at level 6, but whatever. Skeletons and whatnot, they have not moved. They'll move now, probably. Which is what we want. Oh. Okay, he needs to get healed, so we're gonna just leave him back here. Not gonna risk someone dying. Put Gort down there, keep us spread out. Why? Because look, Blaze 2. 
Okay. One and the one above him. Blue is fine. Tau level 9? With the power of Blaze 2. Ooh, ooh, ooh.